My name is Sarah. I'm fond of everything about health, like travelling and fitness. British as I am, I like tea too. We put milk in the tea in Britain. The ways of tea making differ from place to place. So do their flavours. Oolong tea, for example, comes with a distinguished fragrance of awkward only, with its subcategory of Tianguan Yin tea in Anji Quanzhong. I want to know more about the differences. This is Mr Lin, who offers shelter for our trip in Anxi. As a local tea farmer and a native Anxi resident, we are Anxi-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin-Rin
，我们安溪人喝茶是有讲究的，要讲观、听、茶、闻、品。这观指的就是看茶，像这种条数剪器、沙粒线、红点名、叶表、带白霜，这就是好茶。好茶带到杯中的时候。就会发出这种声音，这就是因为茶叶紧结、沉重。要做出这种外形的茶叶，包罗是关键的。在这个阶段中，罗练的轻重缓急，最能看出一个事物的所意。接下来，就是我们说的茶，就是看汤色。这茶是金黄色的，这茶汤金黄清澈，也底肥厚，茶败翻碱，这就是好茶。我们闽南人喝铁观音，最传统的就是用这种碗盖杯。喝茶前一定要先闻碗盖，有一种兰花香的味道。这就是我们平时说的兰花香。只有我们当地产的茶青，在经过最传统的制茶工序后，才会形成安溪铁观音独有的兰花香。这样的香气，就必须要求制茶师傅把握好炒青的火候。火候不大，香味不对，火候过了，茶叶就焦。这茶汤浓，但是不苦，香气高。这个茶喝起来很醇厚，嘴里一直会回甘。要做出这个味道，切了哪道工序都不行。茶叶最后是不是有干香？最重要的就是摇青。摇青这个半发酵的过程，也是我们安溪铁观音最特别的地方。这要靠制茶师傅老传统的经验和说法，随时调整。I assumed that all the products of Tia Guanyin were the same. Yet only once I was here did I grasp the essence of Tianguanyin tea. This heritage of this blessed land consists of craftsmanship and creative ingenuity. This is the only place which produces the Guanyin flavor with scent of light orchard.